In today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to change the default calling SIM card on your dual SIM OnePlus 13. So if you have a dual SIM and you don't want to be asked every time you're trying to make a call which SIM card to use, you can actually set a default SIM card. And if you've already set one, you can actually change it. So here's how to do it. So as you can see, currently, if I try to make a call all the time, it's always going to ask me if I want to use SIM 1 or SIM 2. Now, if I don't want that anymore, I just go to settings. Let's go back to the main settings page. So on this main settings page, go to mobile network and then go to calling. And then now you can choose whether you want your default calling SIM card to be SIM 1 or SIM 2. So let's, for instance, pick SIM 1. I'm just going to pick that. So now from now on, anytime I make a call, it's gonna just call directly with the SIM card I just chose. So that's uh, that's how to that, that's how to do it as a default for any contact that you're calling. Now, if you want to, you can also adjust this default calling SIM card for specific contacts. So you might have SIM one as a default calling SIM card for all contacts, but if there's a specific contact you want to be calling with SIM two, then you can actually set that in the phone book. So if you go to your phone, your contacts, just go to your contacts and look for that specific contact. So for instance, I'll go and pick this contact. Now on this contact page, if I scroll down, I'll see the option to set calling SIM. So I can tap on that and then I can choose uh, an alternative. So I have SIM1 as a default. Now I can choose SIM2, which is also called Safaricom. And anytime I call this specific contact, it's gonna call using SIM2 and while all the other contacts are being called using SIM1. So that's basically how you can customize the default calling SIM card on a dual SIM OnePlus 13. I hope this helps. Thanks for watching. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave them down in the comment section. If you found this video useful, don't forget to leave a like, possibly even subscribe for more tips. I would really appreciate that and good luck.